low. Um, yeah, let's continue, I guess. First of all, you should totally check out this with sound, please. So once you finished watching this video, you can go ahead and check out this, sh this, this absolute masterpiece. Then next thing, um, I actually want to check something out. Like first this, I already tried. Fix for mouse acceleration because last time I turned on my PC, I noticed how much better the mouse works on PC. I have Asus Gladius 2 wireless mouse, which is connected via dongle, and still it's kind of sluggish. I don't know how to describe this, but it feels like I have some kind of a small delay between movement of the mouse and um, movement of my head and movement of the of the mouse. So what I wanted to try out is first to install this because I think this is free. And uh, I can also install it from terminal, I guess. Um. Okay, it runs something. Mm, good, good. Maybe it will solve the issue. I don't know what Apple pro Apple's problem is actually. So it's definitely not that Mac is not supporting the mouse. It's just like it works weird. Let's check. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Mm. No. Yes, I don't know. Um, so first of all, acceleration is on again. Let's check something out actually. Interesting. It did not change it here, but maybe it's just because it's like, I don't know, need to restart it or something. Where is it? No, it still does not show anything here. So let's. see any changes but for some reason oh wait a sec that's scrolling that is for scrolling can you scroll scroll does not work at all right now I guess uh, because it's probably set to zero, that's why it does not work. How about that? Okay, now it scrolls. How about that? It's the same. Interesting. Okay, at least it shows what I am actually changing. I see, okay. It was showing something different right now. Oh, okay, I see now. Got it. Um, yeah, let's, I don't know, keep it like this. This is the default. Change speed, zoom, no. Okay, pointer. So first, this acceleration is on again for whatever reason. 
what happens if I will disable it? It actually feels better already. Let's read the value here. Nothing changed. But it feels more responsive right now. As far as you can tell. Okay, now it's set actually this. Let's check actually. Let's do, set it to some re different value. Here nothing is changing. Shit does. But it feels nice actually like that. This is more or less without any processing, I think. The accuracy is not not ideal, though. I think that accuracy ac ac accuracy on Windows is better. Maybe I should. What if I set acceleration to zero, but speed to something else? I don't know why, but it feels a bit artificial. How the mouse moves here. Okay. Okay, news maybe later. Mm, let's check what else is here. Well, I don't need this, I guess. Started logging, yes. Yeah, I know. Check for updates, yes. Beta, I don't know, I don't need. Bypass events from other application. If enabled linear mouse will Mouse will um, will not modify events sent by other applications such as Logi Options Plus. Ah, okay, that's for proprietary software from Logitech, Logitech, right? So that's how you pronounce it. Okay, let's let's go. I guess. Where is if? I think it feels better now, but I'm not sure. Maybe we'll need to to actually change some some more stuff. Let's put it somewhere, someplace else. Can't put it. Okay, okay, let's just close it. Um, is this something different now, or what? Every login. Okay, this is what I was claiming. And this is something else, something new. Celebration of something. Yeah, we don't really interested. We are not really interested in all this kind of stuff. I changed the por portrait mode a bit. My my character still 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 looks like it has some rough time in life or something, and uh, I can't do anything about it. For some reason, there are space technologies and cloning and all this kind of stuff, but. Still no plastic surgery or, or whatever. Um, okay, it's even here. This capsuleer day 20. Select a faction to receive their agency challenges for this event. And I can select something here. Guri, 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 Malakim Pirates. Or society of conscious thought. These guys have my ship here, so we're definitely selecting this. Mm -hmm. So I will get re rewards if I will attack somebody from the other faction. Um, but. Yeah, sure. I, I don't know. Conscious thought. Beware. Mm. 
Dremio Worm Yua. Yua is cool, it's, as far as I remember. It's also Caldari, yes, it's also kind of Caldari ship. And Worm, I think it's Fraction. No, it's not Fraction, okay. Looks weird though, so the, the color choice, I mean, looks very weird. I'm not gonna do any of this. Um, okay, so what? We will do now. First off, let's check the career gear. Agents and missions, career agents. And here, this we finished. Yes. And um, Still can't get used to the, to the mouse movement for some reason, I don't know why. Maybe it's just me being weird. Probably that's me being weird. Okay, Explorer. Um, what do you want from me here? Probes. I actually don't know what we need to do now. So some people are were sending us to the Eve something something. Sisters of Eve. Whatever, and uh, I think what we need to do is to actually ask ChatGPT to provide us some guidance. Um, wait a sec, let's increase the speed. Feels a bit off too, but here it feels even more weird. It's now it has some kind of a momentum. Um, okay, never mind. Let's see what we need to do here. First, let's check something. Some things here. Um, I think we finished training for quite some stuff. Right now we are training long, long range targeting and shield management. That's all we need. And we also completed Aldari, uh, Kaldarian Enforcer skill plan. Should I... Are we... Completed and that's it, right? I guess. No, no rewards for completing the plan. Um, good. Let's go to the next one. For example, this one. What they want us to train here? Caldari destroyer. I think this more, more or less aligns with what we are going to. Train acceleration control was suggested here. First, let's track this plan. I think this is good to have some kind of a reference here. Then, um, acceleration control is probably in navigation, 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 navigation here. Yes, it's here. Why would why didn't we train it so at all? That's weird. Let's put it here. Let's put it even there because I think it sounds useful. Uh, acceleration control will be two. Caldari frigate we've done. 
spaceships come and come by from the gate. Thank you. Yes, this is done. Okay. Caldera Frigate done. Caldera Destroyer definitely not done. Shield management we are training. Shield operation, I don't know. Shield operation 3, yes. How did I ask it to output, output the original plan? Uh, the original skill training and uh, mark following is done with a check mark energy. I'll put the updated skill plan. I think this will do the trick. Caldera if we gate we stopped here, so shield operation, I guess this is what we need to do next. Shield operation, yes. Um, shield operation, tactic shield manipulation. Tactic shield manipulation two. Yes, light missiles 3, missiles, missiles, light missiles 3, yes. Rockets, do I need rockets? I don't know. Missile launcher operation, missile launcher operation should be... Three and I have four. Mm. The same launcher operation or not? Making this up, right? Yes, it's correct. Signature analysis. Targeting signature analysis is three. Let's see if it, it can it can manage to to change this three to four. Capacitor system operation. This is what advanced fitting. No. Where is it? Engineering. Capacitor system operations. Yes, and it should be three. Why didn't I copy it before? Warp drive operation. Warp. Warp. So navigation definitely. You can wrong place, please. Warp drive operation. This is not done yet. Yes, this is useful, more useful than rockets. Um, I think this is actually also pretty useful. It will unlock some stuff. So yeah, let's unlock things. Uh, warp drive operation, then shield upgrades, shields, shield upgrades, not yet. How long will it take? 14 hours. Let's put it here. Tactical shield manipulation. Was somewhere here. Uh, 
Oh, okay, that's actually also pretty useful, I think. Um, good. What next? Warp drive operation we don't have. Shield upgrades we put here. Caldari cruiser, weapon upgrades. Weapon upgrades. I don't know where it is. Weapon upgrades 3. Okay, that's also done. Small hybrid turrets. Small hybrid turret. Long range targeting. It's somewhere in process. It's here, yes. And um, We can actually mark this also as done, because it will be done by the next time we start to play, probably. So that we are not doing this two times. Exploration and drones, astrometrics. Where is that? It's done already. Astrometrics, astrometric range, range finding. It's not done. Archaeology, hacking, drones, drones. Um, yeah, we can I guess put some some drones here. It also will unlock some stuff, right? Not useful stuff though. Medium drone operation. Yeah, that sounds useful actually. Yeah. Let's put it here. And then here the drones, light drone operation, drone avionics, durability, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's not needed for now. Let's check what will happen now. Mm -hmm. It is preserving. That's great. Salvation control. Didn't we ask it to? No, we didn't. Never mind. All good so far. Um, yeah, I think it managed. And it also replaced this, right? That's nice. Missile launcher operation. That's what we wanted to change. And here it is updated to 4. Amazing! Um, yeah, now GPT is aware about what we have. Yes, great. By the way, drone navigation one should definitely be done, no? Durability one. I don't even have the books for that. How much does it cost? Yeah, I don't think I need this actually. By now, definitely. So, okay, let's now start getting some information from ChatGPT. So, what have we done now? I finished the agent missions. Before, sir, and what was the second one? I forgot. It was Soldier of Fortune. What should I to maximize? Okay, let's see what it will come up with. After completing the agent missions, there are several activities you can pursue to maximize your ISK income as solo player. Exploration, scan down and hack relic, 
and the data sites in low security, null security or warm whole space. Focus on relic sites, blah blah blah. Have a cell date space. I don't know how dangerous that actually is for me. With my skill level, both in terms of game game skills and uh, my personal skills as, as pilot, I think I will lose stuff there instead of actually gain stuff. So I guess we will need to refine the, the question a bit. Planetary interaction. Um, consider my skill level. Although, no, probably it will save this response anyways, right? So we can, we can I guess, just change this. Okay, let's ask it to consider my skill level plan or my skill levels, which are reported in the skill level plan. Uh, those marked with uh, check mark emoji I have trained. Then consider that I am not very experienced. just yet. What's wrong with experienced word? Okay. And um, this would probably do better. Let's try. Second try. Okay, exploration again. Continue running missions for agents. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, exploration. I think we can't really do exploration until we... Start doing stuff. I think running missions and shooting stuff is the best way to go right now. Like this bounty hunter plan sounds pretty reasonable to me. What about this scoop skill training plan? No, I don't think this will help us further. Maybe this one is better. It's 20 hours. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Explorer probably probably also not the best. Not the not the worst way to actually earn money. I think I did this once back then when I was playing Eve. Still, I don't remember anything like how to scan, how to hack, all this kind of stuff. I already forgot, obviously. I think you also need to fight there occasionally, but I'm not sure anymore. So. I guess let's skip this for, for now and spend one or more two days, uh, a couple of days more to just yeah like run mission missions like this path is probably what we will go. Uh, level two and level three missions. This will provide a steady income in income steam and you'll earn loyalty points that can be exchanged for exchange for valuable items at the corporation's LP store. Okay, and here is combat sites, run combat anom anomalies and dead rated combat sites in high security space. These sites <coughs> can drop valuable faction, faction modules and escalations to more lucrative sites. Use a well-fitted combat ship like uh, Kaldari, Karakal or more, we don't have these. Uh, 
and mining. No, yeah, that's... Um... I don't have skill yet, skills yet for skills yet for exploration, but I am wait now training on that skills. So I I decided to go with either missions or combat sites. Let's start with missions. What is the best ship to have to run level 2 and uh, 3 missions? Oh, it's same. What is Caracal? It's cruiser. We don't have cruiser. Why are you telling us to actually use cruiser cruiser when we obviously don't have it? I think it does not really understand what my current development where is it? This is Cormorant. This we actually can't fly. Um Caracal, yes, this is the one. But we barely have destroyer skills. Oh, it is, it is already outputting something. Um, yeah, well, that's great, of course, but right now. I don't have cruiser skills yet. I just learned. Learned? Yes, I think. Destroyer 2. And I have. What do we have? Cormorant, right? Yes. What missions should I run? Is this ship and skills? Provide me with a good fit, which I can afford as newbie player without without investing much isks let's see with your current skill skills and karma and destroyer you can run level one missions and some level two missions okay level three is out of the question by now i guess cormorant is a long range railgun platform that can snipe enemies from distant from a distance. Here is an affordable fit for a new player. It's a railgun platform. Um, I don't think I. Although, yeah, I have like small hybrid turrets, level 3, mm, so I guess... Did it mention something about Corax? What 
about frigate. Does it make sense to fly frigate formation? Okay, let's see what it will answer. Frigates can be used to run level 1 missions effectively, but they may struggle with level 2 missions due to their lower damage output, output and weaker tank compared to destroyers and cruisers. However, frigates are faster and agile, which can help you avoid taking damage from larger, slower enemy ship. And it shows me Kestrel. Kestrel, this is this one. It's a missile ship. Skill training completed. Okay, we have rockets. Okay. And Corax is one and a half million and it is a light missile ship. Yes, I guess we will need to switch, maybe. Although... Let's actually try to, to do our best with the Cormorant. What did it suggest to buy for Cormorant? For example, this thing. Magnetic field stabilizer. Stabilizer. What the hell is that? Ship equipment. This thing. Or this thing. It it wanted me to buy the first one. What is that? Grants bonus to firing rate and damage of hybrid targets. Okay, makes sense. And it is very cheap. And it is available on this station. Alright. What is the cheapest option? For some reason shows me this. This is actually cheaper, no? Why is it? Why? Let's just buy it. Goddamn taxes. This market order will cost two thousand ISKs in broker fees to step to set up. Yes. Did you receive it instantly or or not? What is it called? Magnetic field stabilizer. How do I actually buy things? That's my question. I already forgot what what to do in order to buy things. So. Magnet. And yeah, here, this is it. This is it. Is this the one I, I bought, or is it something else? Or did I have it already? Or what is happening? Um, okay, let's first strip our ship of anything we have here. Is it possible to strip all, everything altogether? So let's first repair. No? We don't need to repair. Um, compare and dock strip fitting here. Yes. Good. Now, let's activate this ship. Yeah. Beautiful. 
I guess so. Now let's put this on and uh, check what next. Free air compact, something, something, compact tracking enhancer. This is also pretty cheap. So far we are good. This one. Oops, what, what the hell am I doing? Um, wait a sec, let's put our windows in reasonable order. Let's close this also. And um, this I don't need for now. Okay, so fitting and this thing is what we need. So Furia something, what? Oh, where? Here. What am I buying actually? Enhances the range and improves the tracking speed. Okay, sounds great, sounds useful. Next, this one. Enduring something. I don't have this one. This is like super dirt cheap. Right? I don't understand why the sorting is so weird. Sort by... Hmm, okay. You can sort by... This is the one, right? Yeah. Medium Asiotropic Restrained Shield Extender. Oh, that's a pricey one. This is a shield extender. We have a shield extender. Medium one. And this is also medium. How do they compare last time? Compare. Um, and I had this one, and let's compare shield, shield point bonus, CPU usage, power grid usage. Okay, it's 100 HP more. How many HPs, HPs do I have like in general? Nine hundred. So one hundred HP is not not little, but for two millions, I'm not really kind of too. Uh, to invest such such much let's medium shield extender okay this is what I have And yeah, that, that's fine. I think this will do for sure. It's uh, yeah, this thing is a bit better, of course, but it's way too expensive, I think. What adaptive invulnerability, uh, invulnerability field? Adaptive involve. It does not see. It does not search for it for some reason. It's uh, it's triggering that I can't remove with a command backspace or 
option to backspace and yeah it's really annoying in well, uh, how do you write this word jesus christ why shield is it not shield Invulnerability core. Adaptive invulnerability. invulnerability. How do we get it? Where did you get this? <laughs> Let's see. Maybe it was renamed or something. I see patch notes here. Oh, okay, adaptive invulnerability shield. Let's search for this one. Still does not search anything. This is patch notes for 2020. Shield hardener. What if I search for adaptive? Okay, search sucks. What a sec. Where? Where was I? Here. It should be limited adaptive and it was renamed in compact adaptive in vulnerability. Let's try again. What the hell? Super weapons, what the hell? I don't get it. <laughs> How is it called now? Maybe it was renamed, renamed yet again. Compact, what was that? Adaptive, no, it's not search for it. Compact, adaptive. Okay, all adaptive and vulnerability shield hardeners have been renamed to multi-spectrum shield hardening. Jesus Christ, that's very unintuitive. So instead of limited, it's compact. Compact. Oh, finally. Jesus, that was hard. Okay. Uh, 250. What is what is that, actually? What does it do? Boost shield resistant against all damage types. Sounds useful. That's why. Yeah. Where is it? Yeah. Okay, we figured it out. So let's mm. let's inform GPT about that.
Yeah, cool. Um, good. So where were we? Um, this we updated. I need to buy the whole bunch of these kind of guns. This this is this was not oh shit that's an expensive gun. I don't have such much money. Um, Let's see what it will suggest. More affordable fit for the Cormorant using 125 Scout Accelerator Cannon, which is a meta version of the railgun. Okay, it updated this. Let's see how much for that. Yeah, that's much better. Okay, you are offering two. I need one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's buy two from you. One, two, three, two, buy, yes. And um, five more. From you, yes. Uh, good, where is it now? Yeah. Insufficient power. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I can't equip them all. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Can I do something about it? Small core defense field purger. What is it? Is it a rig? Small core defense. Well, it's probably not in the equipment. It's just, just here. This is like super expensive shit. And here, this is not so expensive, and this is doing what exactly? Shield recharge and increased ink signature radius. It's in three jumps, and the quantity is enough actually for me to buy. Okay. And so, um, what exactly do we do we need for this? Insufficient power. Power. Stick to six of them. Mm. Okay. Mm. 
Yeah, let's see if we can hit them. How many should I buy? Actually, eight. Right? Right, do I have some money at least? Yeah, I have more than enough. 17,000, yeah, that's fine. Stripping the wall. And putting this wall. What's that? Just... Insufficient power. Jesus Christ, it's unbearable. What can I do to improve power grid? No, it's that. What, what the hell is that? Oh, the way, I can also earn something here. Well, it's, it's not earning, it's actually just an achievement. And they are offering me something here. Give me all. Okay, that's uh, found all, but I need to do something about the energy. Energy grid updates, three days, Jesus Christ, that's a lot. Um, okay. CPU needs now, that's not what I need. Is it, why does it reducing CPU needs? Interesting. What can I do to increase power with Train the skill power grid management. I'm not sure if that's correct actually. So, if the description is, is, is correct, I mean, skill at installing power upgrades, capacitor batteries, and power diagnostic units, 5% requi reduction in CPU needs of modules requiring energy grids updates. That does not make any sense, no? Like, why, why am I reducing CPU need if I'm actually increasing the, C the energy grid? What does CPU upgrade make? Yeah, it does actually then. Bonus to CPU output. Great. Hmm. And it suggested me to core defense field. Okay. Grid boosting module, micro auxiliary power core in the low slot. Low slot micro auxiliary. Let's try. Where is the market? Expensive shit. And this, yeah, let's try it, I guess. I could calculate it, of course, or I could even simulate the fit. But um, yeah, that's no fun, right? What is? What is? So it, it suggests to leave this in, it increases the range and improves the tracking speed. And this is what? Firing rate. Okay, firing rate. Okay, now I can probably fit it in. Where is that? What, what we do? Do we compressed coil? Compressed. 
this one. What the hell is that then? So you can okay. Let's see. Okay, good. Um. Okay. Let's ask whether it has. Yes, I do. Hypnos multispectral ECM. Sounds very. Jesus Christ. Can you stop? Can you stop, please? Yes. Of course, it does not find it. Doesn't find. You can find the, the stuff, but let's see. Just say that I don't even know what that is. Does it go to this? It does not go to the high slot. What the hell are you talking about? multispectral ECM This is definitely not not a launcher. Hypnos. Also sounds super expensive. <laughs> Just for the confusion, you're right. Mm -hmm. Okay. What what was to misunderstand them? It's like super straightforward question. <clears throat> so it does not have any viable suggestions here, so it just says yeah whatever. Leave me be. Yeah. Anyways, let's let's search for something, I guess. Um, Siles. No. Some munitions charts yet that I need. Let me sign a launcher. Which is not CVM in this case. Six twenty one. Probably it's six, right? Yes. And uh, twenty one. Yeah, this this will this will do. Yeah. Although the range of this thing is actually shorter. No, it's twenty two kilometers. And here, this one is. Where is the range? Can you have the range field, please? 
אחד אחד. Maybe it depends on the rocket. Maybe it probably depends on the rocket. Velocity. I don't get it. But whatever, let's just buy one here. Here, right? Yes. And uh, let's put it here. And now we, now we can put. What rockets did I use? These ones. We just paid them all. Crazy shit. Let's repackage this one and stack. Um, no, I think we need first bullets. And second, probably rockets. Calvary, Navy, Antimate, Matter, Matter, Charge. This is expensive shit, no? Let's just do antimatter charge. Yeah, that's much better. Like thousand for one bullet, I will like be. That was a lot of bullets. I will definitely need more. Um, whole two thousands, I guess, will we'll do thousands. Yeah. Maybe more. Mm, that's by five thousand, I don't know. Okay, this that sounds good. Okay, let's find the rigs and that was what I wanted, right? Do I have still money? We have four millions, that's definitely more than enough. Uh, okay, so we will buy three of these. Yes, and now we will fly there. Same destination. Okay, now, um, do we need something else? I think we would. Yeah, I think we are. And um, let's check the missions, I think. So here, this one is depleted, right? This is depleted. Explorer. Can it suggest me things? No, it can't, unfortunately. Where can I find missions? Paragon mission, mission agents. 
um, security. Level one. Current system. No. Within two jumps. Or five jumps. Let's do two jumps. And uh, we can go in the waypoint. Let's go. Yeah, let's try at least one mission. And that will be it for today, I guess. We were using ChatGPT a lot today. I'm very proud of us. Let's see how our, our ship is looking. Yeah, yeah pretty, pretty good, I'd say. So how do I engage autopilot for good? Autopilot engaged. Warping to Stargate. Warp drive active. Is it too tough with wings? It's much slower uh, than the rig, obviously. Okay, let's put all these things together. We will, we will see if we will actually need this. Interesting, it's... I'm shield hard, hard... I have shield hardener. But... I don't have... Yeah, probably... Due to the leaks, it will restore shields faster than we actually will spend it. Which is somewhat tricky and risky way of doing things. I'm not sure if I'm comfortable with that, but let's see. Yeah, let's read some news, I guess. Did I post something funny today? Yeah, it's just like small life hack. If you didn't know, you can actually export. Oh, not export, but just you can just get media files from the office files by renaming the file to zip and uh, just opening this zip file as just normal folder. If you do it like that, you will get a folder with the text and with media, um, yeah, media files separately, which is sometimes useful thing to do. Because, for example, imagine you have a file with hundred images or something. This is an extreme example, of course, but yeah, just imagine. And um, you need to export them all. It takes forever to copy everything or to right click everything and just yeah click save as or something like that and this way you can just copy paste them all at once so the trick is to just rename like pages or docx it also will work with pptx and uh, excel as x or whatever is the format of the excel file then you rename it to zip, then you unarchive it, and then you have the folder. So this is one thing, and uh, another small thing is that for docx files, stock zip unarchiver does not do this for some reason. I guess it's some kind of a different format which docx is using. Maybe they are using rar or something, winrar. So for, for docx files and all other Microsoft Office files, you need to actually install third-party unarchiver and unarchiver will do just fine for this purpose. So yeah, you're welcome. I think we arrived. No, we don't. 
We are. Autopilot yeah, sure. Driving. Something funny. Yeah. Yeah, that was also a fun thing. I actually no, have no idea what they're doing there. But it seems pretty time saving. And the guys are also seem super excited about that. So I guess Autopod for Adobe Premiere is pretty neat. And I was making jokes that, yeah, meanwhile, Final Cut people are just waiting for something to be released, as I think Final Cut is not evolving as fast as Approaching station. As, um, as other editors, unfortunately. Why did it drop off our, our ship so far from the station? What the hell is that? Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Some kind of a buff, so what? Autopilot disabled. Waypoint reached. Okay, so now we have... Now we have here the modules which we need, hopefully, yes. Fitting. Yes. 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 I hope we did everything right. Let's see what we what we have here. By the way, our capacitor is only lasting three minutes, which is unfortunate. Jump to another station and uh, get our mission. And then let's see if the build we are having is any good. I mean, it should do fine, right? So, by the way, are there? Browser, for example, destroyer, Calvary, Cormorant. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that is. That's community. Community fittings, right? So. something oh by the way they're also doing hardener but they have something different I think Web drive active this acceleration is crazy let's see I wish there would be something like a recommended fitting, but I don't see anything like that here. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. So what do we do here? Security is things where you need to shoot things, right? Destroy the habitat of the Gurista Sliver. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, I hope I will not lose the ship in the first fight. Destination set. Warp drive active.
mouse is definitely much more responsive with this. Still not ideal. I think if I would switch right now to PC, I would notice it. But for Mac, it's decent. It's much better. I'm supposed to jump, right? Warp to location. Warp drive active. Yeah, I think I'm there. A shitload of money here unclaimed. And it's also some kind of a book. Which we'll grab later. Warp drive active. So what's the range of this? 19 kilometers. Okay. What do I do here now? I need to destroy the habitat. What the hell is habitat? Let's go there right away. Let's increase our speed. And let's see who will try to engage with us. And let's see what we can do about it. Who's this guy? for 40 kilometers. And we are entering it. How much was it? 19. Okay. And this is um, 11. We've been near the Luda. I guess we can start shooting this guy. And we are damaging this. This guy just got annihilated. Okay, we are doing fine, I think. Let's turn around and speak with stuff. Maybe in the meantime, some, some friends of our guys will arrive. What range do I have here? I don't even know if the range is different from... Okay, that wasn't worth it like at all. Let's go back. But yeah, this build seems to work actually. I mean...
Probably for people who are already familiar with if that's absolutely nothing special. Like they know already what to, to put on the on the ship. But for a newbie, so I would never get this thing. So where is it? So this thing I would probably never come to think that I would need to have something like that. I would probably opt opt into something here, like recharger or something. But that's actually pretty clever what they are doing here. So we are recharging shields by, by using rigs. We are using some modules to extend the shields and stuff. And um, yeah, that all works out pretty well. So I guess for a new for a newbie player, you can either yeah just Google search or something, or if as as we did it, just ask ChatGPT to provide the build. So as we just saw, it works pretty well. I can actually stop engage. Well, yeah, increasing the speed. I I'm not shot by by anyone, so we can just relax a bit because my capacitor is draining not this no, it's not draining so I'm I'm cup stable here if I'm just using the, the guns I'm cup stable so I can shoot indefinitely if I'm not increasing the speed okay I think we are officially done here but let's just shoot everybody here and uh, yeah, as this is gonna be our own uh, only mission today, our three people are flying towards us. Do we? Are they? I think they are. Where should I go? Here, right? That's a line to be so very. And we'll slowly crawl towards that. It's 21 hours. Let's reduce the speed, otherwise they will never get to us. Which is not ideal. I'll let them get to me. And then... Maybe loot them or something. Guys, you're so slow, that's incredible. Okay, maximum of five targets. Yeah, we can start shooting. Yeah, let's recharge, I guess. We have time. Let's kill this one. Let's kill this one. And this one. We have four ships, only three in target block. Shoot this. Now that. Now that. Food. This one has more HP. <clears throat> Let's go with some stuff. Okay, that was super easy. Like, barely an inconvenience. Yeah, like actually no inconvenience at all. I think I can run level two missions also. Maybe we'll try it tomorrow. That's by the way the bullets I'm using. Um, where is my ship? Am I using these rockets? Yes. 
Okay, that was fast and easy, and we can totally do missions once. Mission once. So, although, yeah, that should be expected, right? So, mission once, mission one are intended intended to be done in in a free gate, and we are in destroyer. Full fitted destroyer, maybe not top fitted, but anyways. So it would be weird if we would not be able to do this mission. So how should you, your feet should be in order to actually fail this? And uh, yeah, the actual test will be tomorrow when we will start to use this feet and this ship in level two missions. So let's see how capable it will be. I'm excited to, to know this team. I also wonder how much money can I actually make out of this skin training, some other stuff. Um, I think I'm getting this. Um, where can I see these bounty things is, are also dropping here, right? Yes. Bounty prizes, yes, I've seen them somewhere here. So theoretically I should get some bounty prizes now. And I can also finish this. And this mission is giving us 69 ESK. It's like absolutely nothing. Plus 72 for making it in time. So this is how how much we made. And uh, plus bounty rewards, which will probably be pretty minor. So no, yeah, that's not the way to go. Definitely, that's too easy. Too too little money, and we will need to find something else. We will search for level two missions. Which we currently don't have here. Okay, the closest one is in. Um, is there. Only two people are giving this. And by the way, is this considered safe? Let's ask ChatGPT because I generally don't remember. Is security considered safe to just do missions there? Or do we get in trouble? It's low sec. While it's not as dangerous as null security space or warm calls, low sec does some come does come with increased risk compared to high security space. In low sec, Concord does not actively patrol or respond to acts of aggression. However, there is still a security response in form of, of gates and station guns that will fire upon players with low security status or those who initiate aggression against other players. As a result, running missions in low sec can be more dangerous due to the potential of encouraging encountering other players for players looking for PvP engagement. Okay. If you're a newer player or prefer a safer environment, it's recommended to stick in, in high sec. Yeah, that's what I wanted actually for now. Although I don't actually know why. Why is only why only two two people here are giving me missions?
This does not, does not make any sense actually. Are they searching in a certain region or what is going on? I think I am searching within certain region. Specific region. And this is current region. Let's just click around and see. Any constellation? No ring. Any constellation? No missions. This is weird. Um, why do I have only very few options for mission to? Should I progress? and get standing points or what is going on oh yeah okay let's see yeah basically we are stuck with mission one because yeah because of reasons <laughs> um, okay then yeah i guess this is it we are going to do missions super simple ones uh, one more thing which i wanted to check before i actually leave is if something something like where do i find it Oops, section faction campaign no i don't know where to find it this is not available Paragon agent. I have no idea what the hell is that. Career. Yeah, well, that's what we did. Hmm. Epic arcs. Ah, yeah, that's what what they meant. In fifteen jumps, there is this girl. And she can, yeah, offer us something. As far as I know, though, Sisters of Eve requires some kind of exploration um, skills and modules and whatever. So probably we will stick with uh, mission agents for a while. And we will just do the mission 1 quests uh, until mission 2 in high sex um, will be available. Yeah. Ten jumps, level one. And two jumps, three level ones. Yeah, these two is enough for now. And we have two people here actually offering us um stuff. Yeah. Okay, anyways, we will continue next time. Have a nice one. See you next time.